This is Engineer 775 with a prepping tip concerning chainsaws. Question for you, what are you going to do um, if you don't have enough gas or your gas is bad quality um, or you don't have enough two cycle oil in a long term grid down situation and you need to cut some firewood for your, for your wood stove. Um, I haven't been big on electric chainsaws but this is a, a battery operated chainsaw I want to show you today on here. Uh, Oregon Power Now and it's a 40 volt um, battery pack on this. I'm charging the battery right here. Um, a buddy of mine bought this saw. It's about $540 so it's an expensive saw. Two thirds of that cost is the battery. And uh, Anyway, it's a neat option. It's quiet and I'm just going to pull this off of here. Well, I'm going to show you later. I'll show you um, <laughs> in the next little segment here and then we'll go cut a tree and uh, you know you're going to, if you're used to cutting a lot of wood with a gas chainsaw so there's no comparison but this is a quiet option uh, on one charge you can cut a couple days worth of wood for your for your home for your retreat so it gives you a, another a good backup option so um, I haven't tried any other saws so I'm not going to compare this saw versus the steel I know a lot of steel I know a lot of other manufacturers are considering or have battery operated saws at different voltages uh, this is a 40 volt saw made by Oregon. I just went with this because Oregon, you know, does a great job with their chains and their bars. And uh, now they've got an electric saw. So, you know, it's great to put this back if you run out of gas and oil, or if you just want to be quiet or do a little cleanup and uh, you need to lay low. Um, this, the sound of the bar and the chain, do not carry very far. I've done a few tests, but you know, the chainsaw carries for miles. So, all right, let me show you the saw. Well, here's the little saw. It's an Oregon saw. It's called Oregon Power Now. And uh, it's got a 40 volt, pretty good sized battery pack for it. And it's a 40 volt system. Comes with a charger and a battery pack there. You just push the battery in. Again, the battery is the biggest part of the system. And, you know, I'm in my house right now. Oh, I've got a 16 inch bar and you wouldn't do this with a normal chainsaw, at least not with your wife at home uh, starting up a chainsaw. So, you push the button and you know, it sounds like a sounds like a saw, a skill saw or you know, any other battery operated tool. Uh, this has a built-in chain sharpener so nobody's here so I'll throw some sparks. Oh yeah, right on the kitchen table. Um, don't show this to my wife. But you can actually, I was just sharpening the saw if you saw the sparks fly there. So, <laughs> um, and I'm going to go cut a few pieces of wood. Now, again, this is a buddy saw, so I don't know uh, what he's been doing, whether or how dull this chain is. It, it's not too bad. And um, very easy to work on, very easy to adjust. Standard chain tensioning adjustments. I'm going to go cut just a few branches here and show you. But again, I'm inside the house, just push the button, and you've got a chainsaw. Now they say you could cut, uh, make 15 10 inch cuts, and that's a lot of firewood. On, on, that's on one charge. You might say, well that's not a lot, but that's quite a bit of firewood. And depending on the length of firewood you need for your stoves. So for me, putting it in a large stove, that's pretty, pretty good, that's a lot of wood. And so, worst case scenario, that would get me through a couple days. Of, of burning when it's cold and I you know I could charge the battery back and go again so um, just a, just an, uh, an option for us preppers out there looking for a quiet way to still be able to cut wood no fuel no oil except for bar bar and chain oil but no two-stroke oil no gasoline to worry about just pull the trigger okay let me know what you think and again, I think it's around $550 for that saw, which is a lot of money, but it gives you some options. I have this scrubby little tree that's been bothering me, so I'm going to cut it down with this saw.
you can tell, it's not a powerhouse, but... Still touch the key. Okay, I'm going to make a, just a few cuts with it. Trim up this tree. It's very light. Hit the train brake. The train brake works. size sure beats a beats a handsaw again you can tell it doesn't have a lot of power but if you take your time and uh, not a lot of energy you can use to, to cut up this little tree
I know that's a long video, but I'm still going pretty good with the battery. So, you know, that's, that's enough wood for me, and I burn a lot of wood, but that would uh, keep my place warm for the day. It didn't take but about five minutes to cut up that little tree, and I still got enough battery to cut some more. So they say 15, 10 inch cuts. I believe it if you take your time. So anyway, that's the Oregon Power Now 40 volt chainsaw. Anyway, let me know what you think. I was kind of a toy compared to my Husky 371, but anyway, um, but I didn't have to mix any oil. I didn't have to worry about gas. I just had to make sure the battery was charged. Pull the trigger and you and go. So, all right. Thanks for watching, and uh, look forward to your comments.